Welcome to Books for Kids by Flying Dragons. Tonight we're reading Mr. Men Go Swimming by Roger Hargreaves. There are lots of places that you can go swimming. You can swim in the sea. You can swim in the river. But you cannot swim in the bath. Mr. Tickle decided to learn to swim in a swimming pool. He arrived at the pool and went into the changing rooms. Mr. Dizzy was there for a swim, but being Mr. Dizzy, he was putting on a scarf and gloves. He had been told that the water was a bit cold. Silly old Mr. Dizzy. As you know, Mr. Tickle has extraordinarily long arms, and it turned out that extraordinarily long arms do not make swimming easy. First of all, he tried breaststroke. Mm. Then Mr. Clever showed him overarm stroke. And little Miss Wire suggested backstroke. But for all Mr. Tickle's attempts, he could not learn to swim. So Mr. Tickle decided to sit and watch everybody else to see what he could learn. He watched Mr. Rush surging up and down the pool. He watched little Miss Somersault diving from the high board. And he watched little Miss Naughty bombing little Miss Tiny. Of course, Mr. Tickle, being Mr. Tickle, he could not just sit and watch. He could not resist a tickle or two. He tickled little Miss Splendor, Splendid off her lilo. He tickled little Miss Shy to the surface. And he tickled Mr. Worry into the pool. But how was he going to learn to swim? And then he had an idea. Arm bands. But not just two armbands. Oh no, not with arms as long as Mr. Tickle's. Mr. Tickle needed he needed three armbands for each arm, which yeah. were very helpful for swimming. <laughs> very helpful for swimming, but absolutely no good for tickling. The armbands kept getting in the way. If you liked this video, hit subscribe below. Thank you. Thank you.